Today, I'm gonna be transforming into a reindeer for the next 100 days in Minecraft. And with that, I have found myself trapped inside of Santa's workshop. Oh, and did I mention that Santa's been kidnapped? Yeah, Farmer Unicorn wanted to find a way to make money by selling kids their Christmas presents. And so he kidnapped Santa and now plans to ruin Christmas for everyone. And now it's my job to stop him and rescue Santa within 100 days or Christmas will be ruined for everyone. Hey, look, I am a giant reindeer. Look at me, I'm huge. And when I walk, my head does this little bob thing. But anyway, welcome to 100 Days as a Reindeer. Today, we have to rescue Santa because right now we are 100 days before Christmas and Santa has been kidnapped by the evil unicorn man. So obviously, we have to save him. Now, in the past, these maps have been escape type maps where I have to escape from a farm and try and survive. Well, this time, it's a bit different. My goal is not to escape. My goal is simply to rescue Santa and save Christmas. But I have absolutely no idea how I'm going to do that. But obviously, we get started inside of the reindeer pin. All I know is... Oh. All right, listen up. In case you reindeer didn't get the notice, you're under new management. You understand? I'm the new Santa Claus. I'm the boss now. Anybody who defies me... Gets it! Uh -huh. All right, I'm glad we're out of understanding. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Well, that's why I gotta shut this place down and save Santa. Because clearly, Unicorn is not the person who should be running Christmas. Especially because he's charging kids for their Christmas gifts. Like, how? That is not how that works. Anyway, it is day one. So we need to go ahead and start working on a survival base. Here we go. We'll just grab a few wood. I, sh I shouldn't need too much. Let's look around these chests. We have some hay for food, I've noticed. That reindeer's eating it. Uh, let me check this. Oh, we have some cooked pork chop here. I'll actually take this for now. Okay, now let's figure out where we're gonna build a hidden base. For now, let's hide the crafting table. We'll hide it in this piece of hay right here. Make ourselves a basic wooden pickaxe and then get ourselves a stone pickaxe. Okay, now we just have to decide where we're gonna actually put the hidden base. This would be way too obvious. I feel like over on the sides is also kind of too obvious. Honestly, I may use this spot right here. Like, what if I just do this, okay? I have all these fake haze. We put a hay bale there and there. Maybe one right there. Let's put the slab like this. Yeah, that looks good. And now we can build a hidden staircase down. Okay, this should be deep enough. So we're just gonna lower it by one more and then we're gonna start digging out our base. Okay, now we just need to bring the wall back probably about just a few more blocks and our base will be all set to go. There we go. We have our basic little base put together. And there we go. So now we have ourselves a basic little room that we can get started on to start basically finding a way to save Santa. We'll keep all important items, tools, and resources down here. But with that, I'd say we're in a pretty good spot. So without further ado, let's keep figuring out a way to save Santa, shall we? Okay, so day number two, I need to find a way out of this main gate. Obviously with the base now set in stone for like a good starter base, I now need to find a way to get out of this reindeer pin. I've been kind of looking around a little bit and i'm assuming my best way out is going to be through one of these side paths now this side is too covered in trees and i can't get up there but i think i can get on that block there Let's just leap here I'm not gonna fit anywhere that way i could go this way maybe oh yeah, yeah yeah oh yeah i can get out here am, am i out oh yeah i'm out okay so i found a way out so now let me just have a quick look around oh there's a camera on santa's beard there's a camera in the eye of that nutcracker okay i gotta be careful there's a lot of cameras around i really don't want to get caught okay where's security there's got to be a place to who who uh go back in go back in go not fit come on break i don't think i no hey, i don't no i don't get down from there D yeah hello go I... back in there i'll kill every one of you oh i don't like that yeah hey, come on down show you all my security cameras think you can bust on out mr reindeer i'm not sure you are aware who is in charge around here i'm not no all right follow me where are we going now this here is one of my remodeled little stations for naughty reindeer i put goblins uh, i mean elves in here sometimes too what uh don't come back or if you do learn your lesson what is it okay so i've been sent to a slaughterhouse where it looks like i gotta do some sort of parkour but i think i can cheese it it looks like there's a three level parkour i have to complete but uh i don't think i need it i think i can just jump from this block to this block and get up let me just let me try this real quick Whoa. yeah look at that it worked it worked aha i didn't have to do the parkour the normal way okay we're on to a second part which looks very similar am i good to jump okay i can jump down there's a ladder back up okay what is this gonna do looks like we have something over here oh this is confusing it looks like there's actually activator rails but i don't know what they do okay let's push this 
Now it's going back. Okay, that's going back and forth. What's that doing? Okay, I guess I gotta get all these kind of moving for a sec here. Oh, I see something's happening. I see. I have to get them all moving because this is a parkour using rails, I guess. So now that they're all moving, I can go up here and try to do this parkour. Nice. Okay, this one will come back through. It'll respawn this. No, it got rid of it. Darn it. I was so close. I was doing good. I get it though. I get it. I get it. I get it. So here we go. It hits this. It appears it goes away. It hits this. It appears it goes away. Second, this one appears. I got to go for it. Here we go. Ready? Jump. Oh, this one seems solid. There we go. I think I can make that corner jump. I can. I can. I made it. Nice. What is this? There's spikes everywhere and there's fans. Do I have to use the fan to get over the spike? I do. Oh, but I have to take a little damage almost every time. Huh. Oh, no, I don't. No, I don't. Huh. Okay. If I, if, I, if I do it too long, I can. Hold on. Could I get through those spikes to the end or would I just die? I might just die. Okay. I'm not going to risk that. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Oh, that hurt. Five. There we go. That, was, that wasn't actually as bad as I thought. Okay, where do I go from here? Oh, there's invisible blocks. I see. I got to follow the green now. I'm following these lamps on the ground, and they apparently are going to lead me in the right direction. Ooh, I'm being very careful in case there's anything that falls. This is really tough. Trying to follow invisible blocks is not what I expected to be doing. Ooh, okay, I made it. I made it. Oh, no. Nice. It blocks the fan. Okay, okay. How do I block this one, though? Oh, I gotta throw an item. Let me try this. Oh, my God. It worked. Okay, step on this one. Oh, it gets rid of half. I went off. I see. I see. I get it. Boom. Boom. Ow. Ow. Okay, we live. Oh, that puts two fans. Okay, that'll even it out. That's good. A trick. No, I was sent back to the start. Are you kidding me? Okay, block that one off. The stick is still holding that one shut. Okay, we got past that one. Don't step on that. That's a trick. Jump. Yes, that was the trick. I had to jump. Oh, in fact, I couldn't even hit those anyway. I see. I get it. I get it. I get it. Oh, and then we have this. If I hit this button, this is going to launch me across maybe. Whoop. Yeah. Okay, we have lava above my head, meaning I can't jump. Oh, just walk through, I guess. Okay. And there we go. We're free. Perfect. We survived the first slaughterhouse. Okie dokie. So with that survived, let's make our way back to the reindeer pin so we don't get killed. Uh, but first things first, there's a chest right here. I will gladly take free coal any day. Anyway, let's get back to the reindeer pin before we get ourselves thrown into the next slaughterhouse. I'm gonna go ahead and leave again and start. Oh, hold on. No, I'm not. I see a name right over by my exit. Still gonna head over that way, but I definitely need to go this way because I last time I got caught, I'm 90% sure I saw a unicorn exit from this nutcracker, meaning there must be something hidden underneath it. That's gotta be my goal. And there's these weird glitchy blocks that scream something's there. So just go in here. Whoa. That was so cool. Can I shut them? How do I shut them? They just come back. Okay, what is this? Oh, God. Um, don't kill me. Oh, God. Oh, please don't kill me. Evil elf, please don't. Okay, I'm gonna hit you with my pickaxe. Uh, I can't hit him. Ow! Whoa! He does a lot. Get away! I have a shield, too. How do I hit this guy? Okay, we're going back up. Hold up. How do I fight this man? Oh, wait, I have a stick. Oh, God. Okay, hold on. Am I good to exit? Okay, we are. We're gonna take a piece of wood from this building. Let's go back in. Let's build ourselves a sword to fight this guy. Okay, here we go. Let's fight him. Oh, God. Come on. Yeah! See you later, sec ah! He turns into a smaller security elf. Yes! Oh, that was close. He took down more than half my health. Okay, security elf defeated. Does he have the camera? He does. So this camera monitor gives me access to every single camera on the premises. Now, I could hold on to this camera monitor and use it for my advantage to better, you know, see where Unicorn is and all that. But I've done that in the past, and Unicorn has gotten his camera monitor back. So I just need to find a place to destroy this as soon as possible and destroy it so Unicorn cannot use his cameras again. We went ahead and shut down security so now we don't have to worry about the cameras anymore so we're just gonna make our way back into our pen for now and now we can start figuring out how we're gonna rescue santa because we don't have to worry about the dumb camera after shutting down the cameras i went ahead and started mining for upgraded gear and after getting that i only need to figure out one thing how I was gonna go about rescuing Santa. It has been quite a few days at this point and no Santa found. I know he's gotta be located somewhere within the walls, right? We're not gonna find Santa as an example outside the walls way over there. He's gotta be within these walls. I just don't know where he could be, but I know I'm gonna find him somewhere. Now he's definitely not in the workshop. The workshop literally just consists of the four layers, technically three layers, but it looks like four. And you'll see what I mean in a sec. So we'll go down here. So you'll see we have barracks, packaging, and gift making. Now I know most of this is probably gonna be narrated away, so you may not even know of these three so let me just give you a quick rundown they make the gifts down here they package the gifts there and that's where all the elves live up top so we could check out all these places to see oh no you go away. you get out of here oh you get out of here ugly anyway so while i fight these guys real quick hey you uh, harass my elves no they're harassing me what are you? get out of the factory get out of here out of the factory uh-huh leaving the factory keep going keep all right you guys need to back off get back to work all right you know you're not supposed to be out of the uh your old pen now do you uh yeah i'll give you a name what i'm gonna call you rocky why 
Why? Rocky the dumb-nosed reindeer. <laughs> All right, Rocky, come follow me. That is the dumbest name I've ever heard. Okay, looks like we're going to this big number two building. The big crushing arena. <laughs> the what? I hope you like heavy objects being fallen on your head because that's what happens in here. <laughs> Go on. What? Soon you'll be Rocky the Pancake Reindeer. Now you really don't want to be standing where I'm standing. <laughs> oh God, there's doors that flash too. Here they oh, come. Oh God. Oh wait, they drop wherever Unicorn is. Okay, I understand. Just avoid I'm coming unicorn. for you. Oh God, this is actually really difficult. If I do a little pincer maneuver like this, over this way. Turn around, go this way. Oh my God, he's dropping anvils on my head. This is awful. Yeah, oh, that one was close. Oh, he's coming to try and cut me off. This way. <laughs> come here. I just gotta focus on looking up. Oh, oh, they all lagged. I didn't see that coming. Oh my God. You're tiring me out. I can't. Good. How about not hit you with an anvil yet? I knew I should have shoved more reindeer in here. Oh, I almost got hit. I've had enough of this. Yeah! I survived! Well, that didn't work. Anyway, after that, I went ahead and searched all around to find out where Santa was being kept. And it turns out that Santa is being held in a hidden basement below his house. And to get to him, I'm going to have to get past several layers of security. The first layer of security appears to be some sort of code. So with over 80 days remaining, I have to find that code to free Santa. Okay, so let's make our way back over to where Santa's being kept. Just to double check that code make sure we didn't miss it inside and also just to triple check what type of code it is because i'm confused if it's a number code or if it's just i have to know what button to hit i'm a little confused i want to go double check make sure i have exactly the right idea behind this code okay so let's just go in here uh that is a lot of reindeer heads on the ceiling okay so santa is just down this way let me show you so all you have to do is one of these buttons yeah, I got fire resistance for 20 seconds. So I go in here now and I go down here and look, we're in the basement. So it looks like a phone pad. So I'm guessing these are digits one through nine that I'm gonna have to remember. Okay, that's pretty easy. Let's head back up. Here we go. And oh, 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 run, oh, dear, run. Dear look. Okay, oh, we just, we're gonna glide back in. We're gonna glide back in, ready? Oh, we're He's lagging. On fire. Go, glide back in, glide back in. And we're in, we're in the pen. Oh, blended, blended, blended. Uh, pretend you're eating hay. Mm -hmm. I think we're good. Okay, he seems to be... Wait, what? Is he just going to sit there and guard? He's literally going to sit there and guard the rest of the night away. Oh, my God. Okay, fine. I guess we'll have to wait till he leaves. I'm not, I'm not even going to go into the hidden base. I don't want to risk him finding me. I'm just going to have to play dumb, like a dumb reindeer for a while till he leaves. Okay, so let's go grab some more wood real quick. Okay, unicorn is gone now, so we're going to be good to go back out. Let's just grab some more wood real quick and finish up the armor set. I got the iron armor on. Now we just need to go ahead and put on a sword and a shield. And then we're going to go ahead and make our way to going back and looking for that code. And hopefully this time not getting caught or seen. That would be very lovely. Anyway, let's go up here and let's go look at the top floor now of the workshop to go see what's there. Obviously, up to this point, I've already checked the bottom floor and the second floor for any sort of code or pattern or anything. And I didn't see anything that was really useful. So I just kind of let it be. But we're going to make our way in here real quick. I don't see unicorn, so we should be okay. And all the... Oh, 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 go. He was right there. If he was looking this way, I would have just been caught. Okay, we're good. Anyway, let's keep looking around. We got another chest here. There's an elf spawner there. We got more iron gear. But anyway, we've already looked on this floor for the code. It's not here. So let's just look up here for any sort of code. This is the elf barrack. So I got to be really careful because all the elves spawn up here. I want to check their houses. Do I? But I don't fit in their houses. Maybe there's a way I can turn into it. I just, I can't. It looks like there's a hidden chest down there. Oh, there was. There's nothing there. Though. Okay, that's what I'm going to have to do. I'm going to have to check the, for these hidden chests. That's a toilet. Hidden chest. Yep. Nothing in it. Okay, what is this building? Oh, there's actually a whole area over here that's locked too. What is this? Elf slums. Um, there's elf slums? That's kind of weird. Anyway, what is this? This is this building's locked here too. Elf boss office. Do not disturb Ty, evil elf boss. Oh god. I didn't think it was gonna spawn him. Hello. Oh, you don't have much health. Okay, cool. I'll beat you. There we go. Okay, boss is dead. It looks like there's just a super pickaxe in here of some kind. What is this? Fire auto smelting pickaxe. Oh, that's so cool. I don't even have to smelt anymore. Basement code 910. Is that the code? That might be the code I need. I'm gonna go try it. That might be the code I need to unlock East Santa's first thing. Okay, we'll go in here. We know Unicorn's not here, so we should be good. That honestly gives me a chance to finally look around this building too. First things first. Which button was it? This one? Yeah, it's the middle one. Middle gave fire resistance so I could go in the fire. Now I have to do 910. So we got nine, one. I just noticed there was numbers. I just noticed that. 910, enter. 
Yes! There we go. Okay, that looks like there's a laser security system that is blocking Santa. So I'm just gonna be careful of that. Ready? And go, go, go. Nice. Okay, it looks like we have another block in our way. It actually looks like there's gonna be two. It looks like there's something over here where I need toys. But more importantly, it looks like I need a key card to do this. So let's go back through. Now we have to go find a key card to get us through the next part. And let's get out of here and go back into the reindeer pit. So let's just go over here. Wait for the fire to go away. Okay, fire's gone. Pull out our umbrella and let's glide our way back into the reindeer pin where we're gonna be good to go perfect so we're back inside we finally got past the first part we're doing good we're making progress now after successfully getting the code i now needed a key card to rescue santa so i started looking around in every single crate chest or desk that i could possibly find and sure enough I didn't find anything. Okay, so let's make our way over to Santa's workshop again. And let's just check out the rooms we haven't been able to check out over there yet. Because we haven't had a good chance at looking at really any of the any of the rooms that are upstairs. Because, well, Unicorn's there every time I go. So it just obviously makes it hard. So we're going to make our way into a Unicorn's house here. Or Santa's house, technically. And look around for anything hidden that we may have missed. So, like, right here, this screams hidden painting. Is it a hidden painting, though? I don't think so. There we go. We got some mutton and some steak. There we go. Okay, we got all the food. Let's go check upstairs for anything. Check this. Oh, what is this? And a hat that applies an extra level of looting to killed entities. That's cool. Okay, these cabinets all seem to contain stuff. There's a chest here that has a crystal heart that increases my HP. Oh my god, this is so OP. I'm gonna throw this on and throw my superstitious hat on. Now look at my hearts. Oh god, unicorn's coming. I hear him blowing stuff up. Oh god. Boy, it was a good time jumping around. Gonna do that to my second floor. Whoop! <laughs> Uh, yeah. Okay, go. He went into his room. He went into his room. Go downstairs. Uh, wait, my heads aren't supposed to be walking. Nope, nope. That's not a reindeer head. Get back go, here. Go, 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 go. Fly, glide. Get uh, on away. No, I see you. Uh, get over here. Walk in that pen. I swear I'll kill you. Boy. I'm not walking in the pen. All right. So you're trying to glide around using your little reindeer glide. You like gliding around so much? Let me let me, let me show you something that I got for little gliding reindeers like you. Follow me. Yeehaw! He's just blowing himself up to move around. Woo! Anyway, I guess we're being we're going to Slaughterhouse 3. That's fine. Before you go in. <laughs> Did you just shoot me with a paintball gun? <laughs> Get in there. Okay. There's a gold platform over here. I'm assuming I got to use the gold plat. Do I have to do... Oh, my God. I called it. There was going to be a second jump. I knew it. I literally knew it. Ooh. Oh, my God. Dude, I'm champing this. It's, it's not a dropper. It's a slime parkour in reality. Oh, my God. Come on. Go. No way. Oh, no. There's other rounds. Oh. So, for this one, I got to go over to this side. Oh, Whoa. come on. Yes. Okay. We made it into the first one. This is going to be really hard. We're going to try it. Here we go. Ready? Hit that one. Hit that one. Hit that one. Yes. Let's go. Oh, oh God. There's spikes. I have slow falling. I see now. I see the issue. Okay. We didn't fall in the lava. That was close. Okay. We just got to do this parkour now. There we go. We did it. We did it. Oh God. There's a third. Third. This is definitely a dropper. Oh my God. Woo! Go, 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 go. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, this is going to hurt. Slip right in here. Slip right in here. There's the button. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yes. Yes. We survived. We're good to go. Let's go ahead. Let's get out of here. Let's go back to the pen. We survived that. But anyway, we still got to search around that house, that house. And we still got to keep looking around all three floors of the main building over that way. There's still tons of areas we got to check out with just over 70 days remaining. This is not going to be easy. Okay. So let's go ahead. Let's get out of here again. And this time let's make our way to the second floor and start checking that again, because I have to just keep checking these floors because I'm obviously missing some Thing. Otherwise, I definitely feel like I would have found the key card by now. I feel like I've checked almost everywhere, but it must not be in a chest like I was thinking. So the only place I could honestly think of it being is the second floor of this workshop at this point. And the reason I say that is simply because, well, let me show you. There is an item that's locked up, but again, it's locked up. I, I can't actually get to it. There is a crate inside of this locked building, but there's no way to get in here and it just says precious cargo. So I don't know if that is the key card or not, but there's got to be a way to like open this, right? And I think I'm just missing it. I'm assuming it's on this floor. What is this? Cool. I found a button. You don't think that's for that, do you? I haven't found any other buttons though. Let me look around for a sec. Oh wait, there's one over here. I think I saw red wool. Yeah, yeah, right here. Button found. Okay. Okay, I don't see a third button here. Let me check these things out. Maybe it's inside one of these. Okay, I don't see any here. Oh wait, does this go behind? There could be one back here. Oh, there is one back here. Look at this right here. That's three. With this many buttons, maybe this is going to open that. Maybe that is the key card. Who knows? I'm starting to think it might be. Ooh, ooh. Wait, maybe I should take this up. Yeah, I was right. Look, there's another button up there. There we go. Did that open it? Still not open. Well, we haven't really gone down this way to look for any buttons yet. So let's just double check there's no buttons over here. 
Oh, there's one right here. Hello, button friend. That opened the door? Oh, it did. It's open. And it is the key. It's the key card. It's literally the key card. Let's go. I didn't think I was going to find that this fast. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's jump down real quick. Let's get into Santa's thing and let's unlock it. Okay, up here. We got through this code. We're good. Okay, we have the key card. Let's give it an open. Okay, so it looks like I need to find three different toys and it will open up this door. And I think that'll get us to Santa. I mean, this looks like a Santa prison to me. So I think we're really close to getting Santa free. So we just need to find these three toys and we're going to be good. So we have plenty of time to do that. I'm really excited because it looks like we're going to be able to save Christmas. After finding the key card, I was making great time. And with over 60 days still remaining, it seemed like I was only a few steps away from freeing Santa. Though... I doubt it was going to be as easy as it seemed, because if there is one thing that I have learned about Unicorn's maps, it is that they are never truly easy to complete. Okay, so I knew the toy parts were going to be difficult to find, but I didn't think they were going to be this difficult. I still have none to work with. Literally none. I've looked, I, I think, everywhere at this point. I don't know where they could be. I've got to be missing something, and I just don't know what that something is. Okay, I don't see Unicorn. So, you know, I'm going to actually go check out this one more time. I'm going to go check it over here. So, over over here, I don't know if any of this has made the footage that's going to get cut because I believe I haven't found anything in here. So it usually is going to get cut out. But this building right here is the runway. This is... Who? Who? Hey. I did not think he was going to be in there. Hi. No. Why? What the heck are you... Go take that. Okay. Give that back. <laughs> Give that back. Give that back <laughs> now. I will paintball you. That did a lot of damage, your paintballs, actually. Oh, my God. You ever touch my grenade launcher again, you don't get any more slaughterhouses. All right, listen here, boy. You're going to enter a little death race. What is that? That looks. This looks like one of those old-fashioned playgrounds. All right, come on. What do I do? Going down. Oh, Go down. On. Oh, hi, buddy. Look at you. We're like twins. All right. Listen, you see this? This is the starting line. All you got to do is go all the way around. I'll, I'll let you get a little look at it. I'll go all the way around for the whole track and then come right back here and we're gonna do two laps all right get up on the starting line okay i'm here last place dies three two one go going you heard him last place dies oh that was not the lag i wanted in the beginning okay oh my god the frame lag on this one is bad okay oh my god this this soul sand is slowing me down taking a quick jump Oh, it give me a speed boost. Speed boost gone. Jump here, jump here, jump here, jump here, jump here. Okay, where do I go? We're doing good. Oh, we almost fell. We almost fell in the lava and died. Come on. We have a decent lead. He's he's right there. He's still alive though. We're making great time. What is this? How do I do this? Come on. Oh, it gave me it gave me the glide. Okay, I was like, do I need my umbrella? Okay. All right, lap number one. Nice job. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, oh he's coming. Go. Here we go. Climb this, and we're going. Let's go. Okay, this time we're going to try and take that shortcut down. Look at this. Shortcut. Boom. Look at that. That should give us a nice, nasty lead. Oh, not a great lead, actually. He's still right behind. He may have taken it, too. So we're going to jump here, here, here. Oh, yeah, we're nailing it this time. We're nailing the parkour this time. Yes, we sped through that so fast. Be very careful on the last few jumps. Yeah, we're going around this edge. Oh, we got one coming in. Another one close behind. Here we go. Come on. Make it, make it, make it, make it, make it. Yes. All right. Cross the finish line. Go, go, go. I did it. Oh, we got ourselves a winner. Yeah. Oh, I don't. I, he just, no, he's just going oh. to lava. Oh, Ooh, that was. Oh, that's oh, a bad day. No. Oh, that was kind of sad. All right. Here, let me take you on back. <sighs> okay. Well, we survived at least. That was an intense one. That was a really intense one. So I can't find any of the toys I need to unlock the next part of Santa's prison. I feel like I've checked pretty much everywhere, but so far I can't even find a single one. I'm guessing there has to be some hidden rooms around that I'm yet to find. So I'm going to go ahead and restart from the top and go back and search every single building and this time be specifically looking for hidden rooms because at this point, I just don't know where else to look. Okay, so let's go back up. I'm probably gonna make my way back to the runway to go looking for one of the toys. Since I haven't been able to check out the runway too much outside of my initial search, I'm gonna go ahead and double check it right now, but this time go looking in for hidden rooms because obviously there's gotta be some hidden rooms here because I've searched the base level of every single one of these things. So let's just go over here, grab our umbrella and fly our way in. Okay, so we're looking for hidden rooms. Is that a pole? Is that thing gonna attack me? Are we friends? Okay, the polar bear's friends. Some more presents. Okay, I don't see anything hidden. Oh, 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 maybe? No, 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 nothing back there. Can I climb on this? I can. Nothing there. Dude, there's just not much in here. I guess I could go up on this, uh, let me go up here real quick. Because I feel like there's no way they would just add this for no reason. Am I right? Like, I genuinely have no idea. What is that on the roof? That's an elevator on the roof. Hold up, there's an elevator on the roof. Is there an elevator right here? Oh my god, there's an elevator right here! What? How did I miss that? Please give me something I need. Right here. 
<gasps> a toy! A toy! We have Toy Freddy! We have our first toy. Finally! Okay, we just need to bring that to the house and put it in its place. And that'll be one toy down and two more to go. And we put toy number one in its place. And boom! Now we just need to find two more toys. And we should be able to free Santa. Okay, so we found the first toy on the runway that Santa normally uses to deliver gifts. Now I just need to find two more. I'm gonna continue going around to each and every building and checking around for hidden rooms. It's surprisingly really easy to overlook things that are hidden right in front of you. So I have to keep my eyes wide open so I don't accidentally overlook something important. Okay, so let's make our way up here past our reindeer friends. Excuse me, out of the way. So let's go over here and let's go look for the next toy. So we know that one was in the runway. The odds of there being another in the runway are pretty, pretty, it's pretty low. So I think we're pretty good there. It looks like we were up on that tower there. But let's see if there's any other buildings that have like, oh, I could probably get to that rooftop there. That kind of looks like there could be something there. I just don't know how I'd get up there. We already know about security down below that nutcracker. We know there's three different levels in there that we can search. And we know there's this house. The toy has to be in one of those places. Um, the quick run, run. Okay, we can get back in. He's not going to tell us us. Okay, blend it. Just blend it, blend it. He shouldn't notice. Ha! Okay, he has to figure out. All right, fine. You want to play games with me? Oh, God. Is he just going to kill, start killing him? Come on. You can end the suffering. Oh, no. Is he really going to do this? He's, no, he's going to do this. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Stop killing him. Stop killing him. Oh, it's me. It's yeah. Me. It's you me. Can come it's forward. Me. Huh? Oh, yeah. Yep. I, I recognize you. All right. I'm the slow falling one. All right. Listen, you broke the rules. <laughs> You're locked in. Stay back. What? Wait, what? Ugh. He just rocket jumped over there. There we go. All right, come on out. You know the rules. Okay, I guess we're going so, to a big wooden building. My uh, my only advice to you is uh, watch out for the red square. Red square. I see a red square, so don't step on that, I'm guessing. <laughs> all right. I hope you're all ready for this. Here it comes. Oh, God. Ooh. Is that following Unicorn again? Yeah. It is. It's following Unicorn again. That red square. Oh, my God. We can get under these platforms for cover, though. Oh, they know they open. They open. Oh, God. There's so many arrows. Ah! Okay, get under here. Oh, I see one over here. You're trying to hide. Trying to hide. Oh, yeah, he's Coming. going for the other one. He's going for the other one. Come on. Oh, that. Oh, he took a bit of damage there. Run, little friend. Run. Yeah. Run, little friend. Run. No, stand in the. He's dead. And then go to this one. I see you hiding in the corner. Come here. Come here. Oh, he's done. He's taking damage. If he comes over here, I can punch him. I can punch him. Oh, he's dead anyway. Oh, oh my goodness. Hey, you know what? I think I've, I've teached enough lessons for today here. Yes! We lived this one too, barely, somehow. All right, come on. Come on up to the fence. Wouldn't it be funny if I left you in there forever and you just couldn't get out? That'd be kind of hilarious. You're not I'm not going to do that, but, you oh. know. Oh, oh. So you're not... Okay, it's for just a second, a I thought you were about to put me in solitary or something. But... No, you're not. Just kind of thinking. I will hate you forever if you do this. You see, you all were supposed to die. So if you're not going to be dead, you're going to have to do the time. No. You're going to solitary. No! Why would you... <laughs> we like to call Christmas jail around here. <laughs> oh, my God. Man, welcome to solitary. <laughs> it's literally a box. Your horns barely fit in there, which is kind of hilarious to me. Yeah, I can tell. I can tell I barely fit. This doesn't even look like a place meant for reindeer. All right. Well, um, you just kind of stick down here for um 10 days. 10 days sound good to you? No. No, it doesn't sound good to me. That's a shake. That's a head shake of a green. No, that is a head shake of a All no. All right. Yes, of course. 10 no. days. No. 15? No, definitely not. Just 10. Okay. Understood. I hate him. I hate him a lot. After getting caught again, I not only had to go through a slaughterhouse, but Unicorn also decided to throw me in solitary for 10 different days so I would learn a lesson. Anyway, after I got out of solitary, I have to continue to look for those toys because at this point, I have been looking for them for an extremely long time and I have only found one. I have to speed up or I may not be able to save Santa in time for Christmas. All right. Hello? Uh... Yeah, am I free yet? Are you? I don't even yeah. think it's been. Oh no, it is. It is day sixty-seven. Never mind. Yeah, I'm free. Let me out. I big I, dumb nose. I thought I on still in. had one day left in this bad boy. Freedom. All right, go on. I know. Get moving. I'm going back to the pen. I'm going. I'm not staying, but I'm going. Okay. Yeah. You escort me up here. Perfect. Beautiful. Lovely. Love it. I'll even hit the button for you. You can close it up. Ow. 
<laughs> okay, so now we're back in the pen. It is day, what day is it again? 67. And so we got to still find those toys. There's still two toys remaining and I have no time to waste. So I'm, I'm actually going to just yeet out of here real fast. And go look for these other toys because I honestly, uh, I don't know where they could be at this point. So uh, that's where I'm going. Okay, so let's go this way up here. Okay, so there's really only a few places for these toys left to be. So I'm just going to start going to them. I need to get to this factory floor anyway because this is where I'm probably going to find one of the toys. Okay, so we'll just go in here and we're going to start at the bottom and we're going to go through all three. We're going to start toy making, go to packing, all the way up to barracks, trying to figure out, don't murder me, don't murder me. Oh no, you're, you're aggro. You're aggro. That's fine. Bring it on, dude. I love the sounds they make. They're just like, ah! Okay. Here we go. So toy making. Okay, we right once again we're at the, this area. We got all the toy creepers, the the little, little little toy creepers. They like they're like little live robots. Okay, we know in here we got the paintball guns. So as an example, I can simply take the paintball gun and go. Not that that's really that useful. Can I wait? Can I push them maybe? Okay, so there's no pushing them. I was seeing maybe if there was a hidden puzzle there I didn't know about. Because that's just some paintball guns. There's got to be something I'm missing here. Is this just a bouncy castle? Literally just a bouncy castle. No, let me out of here before I get stuck. Okay, what other toys do we got? We got a Rubik's Cube that's already solved. Some basic target practice. We got what looks like a little trike race. Maybe if I move the trike to the other side. Okay, that didn't do anything. We got the Rubik's Cube, which doesn't seem to do anything. Uh, bedrock. We got a tank. Does the tank do anything? Maybe I can like blow up the bedrock. Is there a button? <gasps> no way. No way that just worked. Oh, no, it didn't. Oh, the bedrock's meant to just be where the explosion hits. Oh, dude, I thought I was on to something. What do we got here? Toys for naughty kids. Oh, it's a pit of coal. Let me make sure there's nothing under this coal. No, there's not. Okay, cool. And then we have this mine cart here. Is there anything in it, maybe? Come here. I don't... No, my coal. Get back here, you. You fiend. Give me back my coal. Are you kidding? It took my coal. Dude, what the heck? Okay, we got a couple things over here. What does this do? Oh, it's like a jack-in-the-box. Hold up. How do I... Can I get in there, maybe? To the dragon? Huh. Okay, we can jump here. Oh, wait, we might be onto something here. We might be onto something here. So get here, jump there. Heard one of the elves. Okay, no, I don't think that's it. Uh, unless I can, can I make this? Oh, I can, I can. Oh. I don't think this is anything. I'm taking the dragon head. Can I put it on? Oh, you can't see it though. Oh, that's unfortunate. I'm still taking it. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet, but I'm taking it. So I don't think any of this does. Oh, I thought there was a unicorn for a sec. It's just an elf. Okay, he's dead. I guess I'll just make sure this doesn't do anything and make sure it's nothing more than just shooting practice. White peppermint rod. Okay, looks like we have candy cane cannon here. Just make sure this is nothing. Light one, light two, light three. Did I just hear a noise? I'm 99% sure I just heard a noise. I thought I heard something break over here. Is it the bedrock? Oh my God, it was. The bedrock broke. Yes, we have a toy. We have a toy. We have a toy. We have a toy. Oh my God, I was right. We had to literally play the games. Well, I wasn't really right because I guess I ignored the one game I needed to play, but that's fine. We still got it. Okay, let's get out of here really quick. Okay, we got to get up to Unicorn's house. Santa's house. I keep calling it Unicorn's. It's Santa's house that Unicorn stole. So let's get up to Santa's house real quick up here. Okay. Okay, down we go, hit the button, the fire resistance again, pass the lasers, pass the key card, and now let's put toy number two in its place. We have the toy tank. So now we have a toy Freddy, a toy tank, and we just need to find toy number three, and I think we're gonna have Santa free. After finding the second toy I needed, I now only needed to find one more and I would be able to get to Santa. The question obviously is though, where is this last toy? You see, I feel like I've searched everywhere at this point. So either I am truly missing something or the toy is hidden in one of the slaughterhouses. Meaning I might have to get myself caught if I want to get this last toy. Okay, so I obviously don't want to go to a slaughterhouse, but I'm starting to think that there's no real other option to get the next toy without going to a slaughterhouse because I've checked everywhere. I can't find this last toy in any of the buildings, like anywhere around here. And I've searched them all in depth like I'm not kidding when I say I've searched them it's not there this toy cannot be in any of those buildings I, if it is I will literally go I don't know shove my head in some dirt like an ostrich but I promise you it's not okay I really don't know where it is though so this time around I have to try something new. I could try to get myself caught into a slaughterhouse. I could, I, like, th there's a lot of things I could do. I'm gonna try and avoid, to be honest, getting caught into a slaughterhouse immediately. But if by day 80, I'm not, I'm gonna have to do that. So, so for now, no, we won't get caught and go to a slaughterhouse. But we do have to figure out where this thing is. And I'm guessing it must have to do with these uh, nutcrackers because that nutcracker had security in it. But the other nutcrackers don't seem to have anything else. How do you always find me, dude? This is not even cool. How does he always come up behind me every single time I'm on that corner? Where'd you go? 
Oh, he lost me already. Oh, God. Thank God. Oh, go over here. Go, 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 go. Quick, go, 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 go. Okay. We ditched him for now. We're good there. I thought we were about to get caught, which would have really stung because I'm not, I'm trying not to go to a slaughterhouse, I decided. So I guess we can go check around back here uh, by slaughterhouse three. Was this the dropper one, I think? Okay. There's a nutcracker over here. This is what I want to check out. I feel like the nutcrackers definitely have something to do with me getting this last toy because they're like a big toy, right? So let's check. Ah, I knew it. Oh, it's just a villager hat. Decreases trading price of village. Oh, that's not helpful. There's another chest over here. A whoopee cushion. Some armor. Some coal. Okay, so nothing overly useful here. Oh, unicorn's coming. Oh, God, he's coming this way. Uh, get around back to this building, whatever this building is. Oh, wait, what the heck is this building? I've never even seen this building. Wait, what? Oh, yes, I have. Yes, I have. This is the one that I, that's completely walled off. Oh, wait, I bet you the last toy's in here. How do I get in? There's got to be a way in, right? It's completely walled off, though. Yeah, oh. I thought I saw oh, you. Oh, come already. on, dude. Where can I go? Where can I go? Nutcracker, 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 Nutcracker. Oh, no, he's exploding really fast. He's, he's right behind me, isn't he? Cover well, well, well. I, I'll, I'm going to accept my fate. I wanted to get caught anyway. I had to use my expert tracking skills to track you down. I saw you up on the hill, but you just done plumb disappeared. You should have seen it. I was sniffing the ground. Yeah, that's great. I still got away. Well, I guess did, I didn't get away. Did you away. poop at some point, by the way? Or was that another deer? Feces, I smell. Regardless, look, you're getting a punishment. This better be worth it. There better be something in this slaughterhouse because I'm at a loss on where this toy is. Unless it's in that locked building, but I, I don't even know. I have no idea how to get into that one. Hey, there it is. There she is. This is a this is a bit of an icebreaker of a, of a slaughterhouse. Icebreaker? Except there's no ice breaking, and the only thing breaking is bones. Oh, here I am thinking that you're going to, like, be sending me to, like, something where ice is falling and ice does not fall. Enter arena, bring back winner. All right. Head on in. Get ready. Whack your opponents into the... Oh, oh, oh. oh, those opponents. They're ramming each other with their antlers. I'm assuming this is... Yeah, this is my antlers. The whacking stick. It says hit them in... Oh, there's lava below us. Oh, whack. Get him in. Get him in. Oh, God. Now he's whacking me. Get out of here, you. Ah! I don't want to go in the lava. Oh, this one's close. This one's close. Hoop, hoop. No, 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 no. Get him on the crit. Yes. Oh, he's in. He's in the lava. There's one more. Oh, there's one more. I can get him in. I can get him in. I can get him in. Crit. Oh, I missed. I missed. I missed. The lag. The lag. No. There we go. Crit him. Crit him. Crit him. Crit him. Crit him. Burn me. Oh, he lived. Oh, he walked in. That's kind of sad. Oh, we got ourselves a winner. Oh. That was terrible. Oh. Nice job. Nice job. Yeah, I couldn't see anything. I literally watched the reindeer end its life because it didn't want to face you. Look, I don't know what your uh, what your weird snorts and whinnies mean. All right, I'm taking you on back. Yeah, okay. After getting caught and still having no idea where this last toy was, I was honestly starting to lose hope. Because I truly was lost on where this last toy could be. I was going to have to find it extremely fast if I was going to be able to beat this challenge and save Santa. Okay, so let's make our way over to one of the nutcrackers simply because I think I figured out what I have to do. So there's a building in the back that is completely locked up, right? I can't see inside. I can't see anything. And I noticed that a bunch of these nutcrackers in their backs have chests. So I bet you if I loot all the items and all the different nutcrackers that have items, then I'm going to open up that building and that should give me the next toy i think so that's what we're gonna try right now so let's just go over here yeah this nutcracker has a chest i already looted this one does it have one around back nope none around back so this one's in the clear we have to check all the nutcrackers though so we're gonna go start by going this way and working our way around from nutcracker to nutcracker double checking to make sure we clear all their items then we're gonna check that building so let's check around back this one maybe the security one also has one it does. We got a katana and a golden hook. Increases experience dropped by creatures, especially those you've not recently killed. So we got some more items. So let's go this way now. I'm going to hug the building just so Unicorn doesn't see me, nor do the elves if he's inside. Okay, we're going to quickly sprint across. Don't see me. 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 Please. Wait, hold on. There's a bunch of signs right here. Were these here? These have definitely been here, right? Maybe they give a hint. Get back to work. Mandatory tea break starting Monday. Karaoke meet at eggnog bar upstairs. No pomegranates. No, 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 no pomegranates. Union meetup if interesting. Okay, nothing. Nothing of use there. I was hoping there would maybe be like a clue or something, but I don't think so. Unless I'm just missing something there, which I very well could be. Let's check around back this nutcracker. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. We got a fire gauntlet and chain mail. Not that I need the chain mail, but now my, it looks like if I put the fire gauntlet on my melee attacks, also light things on fire. That could be super useful. Yeah, I'm definitely taking that. 
Okay, let's go to the next nutcracker. We also have two up on the hill. Okay, I don't see any back here. That means the next two are gonna be up on this hill. And there's one in that back corner over there. Let's just go check these ones on the hill, make sure they don't have any chests or anything. Dude, I just realized that's an elf on a shelf sitting up on the mountainside. That's terrifying. Okay, there's nothing at this one, and there is nothing at this one. Okay, so these two don't seem to have items, which is kind of what I assumed would be the case, but that's fine. And then we go to these last few over here, and I think that door should open up. I think. It, it is a kind of a shot in the dark, but I think I'm right. I think I'm dead on with this. Okay, go around here. Yep, booyah. Vampiric glove. I absorb health, and now I have an iron helmet. There's also items up here. I'm just gonna grab them. I don't think they have anything to do with it, but I'll check just in case. Just a bunch of snowballs. I'll take some snowballs. Let's go back around to these other nutcrackers in the back here, or singular nutcracker. Grab any items out of here that we need to grab. If there are any items. Okay, I don't see anything. Oh, no, no, there is a chest. There's a chest. Okay, this just has a book. Hold up, hold up, hold up. This just has a book. The door is now open. Wait, did I just need to get this one? I may have overthought it. Maybe I didn't need all the nutcrackers. Maybe I just needed one. But it, this one says the door is now open. So I think... Yes, it is, it is, it is. The choice is yours. Sorry, nothing. You got trolled. I hate you. I hate you, unicorn. I can't believe that was a false lead. Ugh, I'm going back to the pin. I'm disgusted after what I just witnessed. Okay, so obviously we were totally misled on the last day. So we have to go back out and look again. And this time I'm not gonna be misled by some stupid nutcrackers. So we have to find this last one, wherever it might be. And here's the problem. Checked it. I've checked it thoroughly. I've checked all the nutcrackers. I've checked everything in this place. I've even checked this building through and through, both floors, everything. Like there's nothing that is even remotely close to a toy in any of them. So I really don't know where I'm going next. Yeah, I guess I just gotta keep looking. I, I like, I don't know, cause I feel like I've checked everywhere. So if I go out, I'm just risking getting caught for no reason. Okay, whatever, let's just go, let's go, let's go out and we'll just come back before the, the sun rises for the next day. Okay, so obviously that didn't work. Another day, another not found uh, item, which is really annoying. No toy, no nothing. So we're going home empty-handed yet again so i guess we're just gonna have to look for it again tomorrow yeah i i just i don't know where it is I, I'm, I'm stuck right mr dragon we're stuck forever we're gonna be stuck in this world for i like this though i like my little addition to the base at least so anyway let's go back uh to the underground and i guess we can just mine for the night and see what we can come up with i could build a better shrine for our dragon i guess i just don't know what else to do with the time the only thing out there is to really look for the uh the thing and all we have is the dragon anyway, let me move the dragon real quick let's move it let's grab you Wait, what? Oh, I found some hidden things here. What item am I got? A Rubik's Cube. I don't know what good that is, but wait, is that a toy? Is that meant to be like toy three? I don't know if that's meant to be, is that meant to be toy three? The other two were heads too, were player heads. And this is also a player head. I'm gonna go try it. I don't know if this is the last item I need, but it might be. Let me go quickly try it at Unicorn's or Santa's house. I'm a little confused, I'm not gonna lie. So give me a sec here. Make sure Unicorn's not here. I don't think he is. This should be the last item I need, I think. We'll find out. It was! It literally was it! Oh my god, Santa! I found you, but you're stuck behind reinforced glass. So that kind of makes it hard to break you out. Can I use my fiery pickaxe? No, that doesn't help either. This stuff's not breakable, Santa. I can't get you out yet. I'm sorry. I will get you out of here, Santa! Don't you worry. You have cookies to be eating. You're looking really thin before Christmas, and that is not good. So I'm gonna get you out of here. I'm gonna free you so you can eat all the cookies and get fat again. Perfect. Okay, I'll be back, Santa. There's only one more wall between me and you, and I guarantee I can get through it. Come on. Yes, we found the last toy and finally opened our way to Santa's jail. Now we just have to find some way to break Santa out of the jail cell. I don't see a key or really anything to break him out, but there has to be something. So I'm gonna keep looking around for it wherever or whatever it may be. Because rescuing Santa is my number one goal. Okay, so let us get out of this place again. And now we have... I'm so sorry I just lit you on fire. I forgot if I punch things, I let you on fire now. Anyway, uh, we have to go ahead and figure out how to break the glass in front of Santa. Because my pickaxe wasn't working, neither was my fist. And there's no items anywhere that I've found that are going to help me break down reinforced glass. So I need to figure out how I'm going to get past that and free up Santa for Christmas. So what I'm thinking about is the fact that normally Unicorn hides stuff inside the slaughterhouses. So I'm tempted to get myself caught. But the thing is, is Slaughterhouse 7 was around back and it had a giant mountain, which I believe... Oh no, it's over here. Yeah, it's this elf on the shelf guy. That's Slaughterhouse 7 up there. And that just has me nervous. Because one, 
Elf on the Shelf is already a terrifying concept as is. But it also makes me think I'm going to have to fight Elf on the Shelf. And I don't want to do that. But it also sounds kind of fun. So I think I'm going to get myself caught here. Find out if we get anything from this. And then go from there. And if not, we'll get ourselves caught and go to Slaughterhouse 8. And if we find nothing in there, that should still give us time to look around and figure out exactly how we're supposed to break that glass. But I think that's probably our best move is to get through these Slaughterhouses. So let's go ahead. Let's go to Unicorn or Santa's house, excuse me. Let's grab the rest of the items in there we haven't actually had a chance to grab yet. We'll kind of just go from there and let ourselves get caught, I guess. So let's go up here. Is there anything in this drawer? No. Oh, there's an elf right there. I didn't even notice him. He didn't notice me either, so we're good. Okay, that's just coal and stuff. Coal. Yo, that's a stack right there. Okay, here comes Unicorn. I hear him. I hear his explosions. Okay, we'll wait up here. Let me quickly just loot these. Oh, we got tons of mutton. I'll take that. Get out of my house! Oh, he sees me. He sees me. Good. Yeah, that'll teach you. Oh, Dang he's... old elf. Oh, he's talking to the elf, not me. I thought he found me already. Okay, his room's empty. That's that's all of it. Okay, now I'm just gonna walk down the stairs. Like casually. Casually walk down the stairs. Here we go. And then I'm just gonna casually walk out the door. Here we go, ready? Let's watch. Here we go. Do -do 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 -do. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. We're just gonna walk down this hill. Pretend we didn't see him. Hey! Were you just you're out of your pen! Is there a problem, officer? You think you're funny, boy? I'm hilarious. With your funny moose nose? I'm a reindeer. I'm not even a moose. Uh, I know someone who's a little funnier than you. <laughs> Come on. I, that makes me really nervous. I think he is bringing me to I think that, I think I'm about to fight Elf on the Shelf. I really do. I think he set up an Elf on the Shelf boss, and I think that's what I'm about to fight. Because I don't know what Unicorn builds, how he builds these maps. So I know he set up something creative, because every single time there's something new with these dumb things. And I guarantee you it's going to be this. Oh, please don't do this to me. I mean, I guess I did to myself, but you know what I mean. There we are. All right, now you go on and introduce yourself now. You'll get a warm welcome. Tell them that I sent you. <laughs> okay, well, here we go. Where is it? I'm telling you, there's gonna be, uh, there's gotta be, maybe not, maybe not. Ha-ha, wee! Whoa! Ha-ha, 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 ha-
Please, no! Okay, I don't know if I can make get up there. I... <laughs> Poor defenseless! I'm coming for you! That's fine. Oh, ooh, he got me good there. He got me good there. He got me good there. Oh, I'm trapped, actually. Oh, oh, get me! No. Get him, 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 get him. Oh, he's low. No, you're not getting away. No, you're not getting away. Darn it, dude! He keeps getting away! Okay, let's go to the knocked over rocket over here. I have an idea. There's oh. gotta be a way up there to stop him. I feel faint! I'm gonna get him. He said he feels faint. He's running. No, oh, stay back! Stay back! He's no. on fire. Yes! See you later, elf on a shelf! I'll see you later, you dumb elf! Finally! Oh my god, that thing was annoying! Okay, how do we get out of here now? We gotta find a way out. Wait, do I just go back up the ladders, maybe? There's another e exit up there. That could also contain the item I need. I really don't know. Okay, let me go. Oh, wait, I'm stupid. I'm so stupid. I could have gone up the trampoline just by going back up the ladder and over here. Onto the car, up here, and I did it. Look at that. That was easy. Now, is there anything over here in that other hole? Oh, I don't even think there is anything. No, there's nothing. Wait, I'm, I think I'm supposed to just go out the way I came then. Maybe that ladder just reappeared when I killed him. Uh, maybe. I, I don't know. I really don't know. Hello. What? How are, how are you alive? I killed the elf. <clears throat> All right. Fine. Next time I catch you out, you're getting it good. <laughs> After getting cut again, I was getting fairly nervous. With under 10 days left in this challenge, I still couldn't find the item I needed to free Santa from the prison. With the limited time I have, I decided I had to check out Slaughterhouse 8 just to confirm that there was nothing hidden in there. And boy, oh boy, am I glad I did. Okay, it is day 92, making great time. We're just gonna take this day now and we're gonna probably to make the day today the day that we end up going out of the pin so we can go to the final Slaughterhouse and just make sure that it's not gonna drop any items that we may need because obviously if we need items, that would be really, really bad. So uh, make sure that we clear all the slaughterhouses then if we don't get anything out of that we're gonna have to check over all the other areas in the last basically week we're gonna have to make sure we can escape so first things first though gotta go to that slaughterhouse and make sure that the item we need isn't gonna be found there so first things first where the heck is unicorn i'm waiting up here so it's easier to see him let's go to his house real quick i don't have any cobble on me i was gonna say let me block off his door is that really get his attention oh i heard something what is that noise Oh, it's him. It's him. It's him. Okay. He's here. He's here. He's here. Okay, ready? We're going to jump out and surprise him. Ready? With snowballs. Ow! That hurt. He actually blew up his painting. Who's sticking their head through my wall? Oh, am I going? Oh, my God. He... What do you think you're doing? Did I really just get found because my body is clipping through the wall? Are you get kidding me? Wall. What the heck, dude? You're going to mount yourself. At least do it the other way. Unbelievable. You know what? You... Oh. You're rocky. Yeah. The dumb no. That's it. You're going in the naughty pit, man. No. You're going in the naughty pit. Here we go. It's time for the last slaughterhouse. I really hope there's an item here. And if not, we got a week to find the last item. Okay, it's this tiny little hut over here. That just screams it's a teleportation hut. It's gonna teleport me somewhere. You're gonna spend some time in the naughty pit. Oh no, it's literally a We're naughty. Being pit. naughty. Okay, Robo Santa. Oh God, Robo Santa. Is that Robo Santa? Is he gonna attack me? Hello, I gotta kill you. So, I oh, yeah, he was waiting for me to attack. Okay, he's attacking. Oh, okay, we blocked it. We blocked it. Nice. Retreat. Okay, my shield is definitely out of. I cannot do anything. Oh, he's mini creepers. What the heck? Oh my God. Ah! Get away, dude. These things are strong. He's on the roof. He's on the roof. He's on the roof. Okay. Get up here, get up here, get up here, get up here, get up here. Okay, I can hide up here. We got a shulker right here. Nice, we have a bow. We got a bow. There's actually a shulker right here too. More shulker and a rifle. Hello, where are you? Oh, I hit him. Oh, I, this thing can't reload. Okay, oh God. Get away! Okay, he's up here. He's up here, he's up here. I gotta get up here somehow. Oh no, he's coming in, he's coming in. Come here, dude. Oh, we got him good, we got him good. Back off, back off, back off. I missed. Oh, on me. Oh, the boat is a lot. The boat is a lot. It's a lot better. It has knockback. Go! Oh, they're freezing him! Oh, ooh. He's sucking me in! What? Ah! I killed Robo Santa! But he sucked me in at the end and almost killed me. We're alive? Okay. What's in here? Santa's OP potion. Okay. We got some other stuff here too. Let's loot it all. It, any of it could be useful. We got a novelty drinking hat. Is there anything else over here? I just have to make sure I have everything. We got an orange one right here. Did I loot that? No, we have just some healing potions. Okay. I think I've won. Oh, 
I got teleported out. I'm done. I got it all. Okay. 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 So let's go through what we got back in the pin. Let's get to safety for a second. Now that we're safe, let's go through what we got. We have a bunch of, okay. Most of it's actually pretty useless. We got a rifle. That's pretty good. Some arrows. This is the one that's caught me off guard. We have a Santa's OP potion. This potion could be what allows me to break Santa free, but I, I don't know if it does officially, but I'm pretty sure this is going to be our trick. So oh, do I give it a drink now? No, no, no. We'll wait to give it a drink because we have to wait for day 99 to let Santa out. So that way we complete the 100 day challenge and we let Santa free. If this potion is not to let Santa free, then I might've just accidentally screwed myself up, but we'll find out on day 99. I officially got the last item I need to free Santa from his prison. And so I waited until the right moment on day 99 to make my final move. And so with it being day 99, it is time to drink my OP potion and go rescue Santa. So let's go ahead. Let's do that real quick. Let's get to Santa's prison. Let's let him out. And then let's let Unicorn face Santa once and for all because no one, and I mean no one, can beat Santa. So let's go ahead. Let's head down here to drink the potion. And then we're going on in. So I drink the potion and let's see what happens. Drink, 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 drink. <laughs> this isn't an OP reindeer. I just turned into a moose. I literally drank it and turned into a moose. This is not an OP reindeer. This is a this is this is a moose. What is this? This is not. This is literally just a moose. Let's go rescue Santa before this wears off. And I don't. I'm not a moose any longer. But I think as a moose, I should be able to break down Santa's cage. Let's just go test it out. Okay, unicorn's up here. I should. This shouldn't matter. I think I'm gonna be okay. Let's just with our big moose body. Okay, get, let me. Oh, I have to break the Christmas tree. Excuse me, coming through. Big moose body coming through. There we go. Get on in here. Oh, we don't. Oh, no, we, we do fit. We're, we fit barely. Oh, no, these blocks will make us not fit. There we go. Now we fit. Down we go. Oh, we got to get out now. There we go. We're out. Give us fire resistance back. Okay, now we got to get through these lasers without getting caught. Oh, God. Oh, we accidentally set them off. Okay. Okay. As a moose, I should just be able to break. Oh, I can. I can just break right through it. Come on, Santa. Come on. You're free. I'm still burning though. Why am I still burning? Am I just infinitely gonna burn? I'm trying, Santa. I really am. I promise. Wait, wait, Santa, can you use your wish magic to give me Oh, it stopped. I was gonna say wish wish me uh off of fire. But anyway, here we go. Come on. We gotta get out of here. Go through here. Watch out for the lasers. Okay, never mind. Just run through, Santa, run! Santa in here, up here! Making all that ruckus. I Oh! What Santa, how'd you get out of Is that a moose? I'm an OP reindeer, and I'm on fire, apparently. I am lost for work. Listen, I, I can't have this happen. I'm sorry, Santa. I said I wouldn't do this, but I'm doing it. Oh, God. Santa, use your wish magic. Get rid of him. <laughs> Santa, no, 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 no. Santa, I can't believe you did it. You wished Unicorn away. I don't know where exactly you sent him, but that means the North Pole is ours again. Thank God you're like kind of a mythical being who can just kind of wish things to happen. Though I will say that box that contained you pretty strong stuff, but I finally got through it. Anyway, at least we can now have Christmas. That means my 100 day challenge of saving Christmas is officially over as a moose, I guess. But you know what? We did it. 100 days as a reindeer is now complete and Christmas is saved. Happy holidays, everyone.